God's will at Pabio back to farm initiative aimed at revitalizing agriculture and encouraging commercial farming has officially been launched in Ikotekpene local government area, Akwaibum State. The event held under the office of Senior Special Assistant to the Senate President on Youth Matters, saw wife of the and also saw the wife of the Senate President, Senator Godzilla Pabio, Mrs. Ekaite Unoma Pabio, represent her husband to signal the start of the new agricultural drive. In his opening statement, the special advisor to the Senate President on Youth, Mr. Emmanuel Amama, highlighted the essence of the initiative which primarily is the provision of food sufficiency and agricultural training for all Aquibomites. As we are here, we are in the premises of the Unoma Gosfield Apabio College of Agricultural Sciences. And this particular center is His Excellency Senator Gosfield Apabio Agricultural Center. The initiative we are embarking upon today is the Back to Farm Initiative. Mommy, we want to thank you because we know that anything that your hands is upon is fruitful. And we are very sure that in the next three months, people that will visit this place would find a greenish environment grown with tomatoes, grown with garden eggs, Grown with pepper, grown with, grown with uh, garbage, and what have you. Garden egg will be grown here, and then we will have them. Our much talked about cassava. There's no way you could do farming in our land, and you would not include cassava, and then your farm would be complete. So we are very sure that anybody that will visit this center in the next three months will find a greenish environment are done with these crops and in the next one year we would be feeding the whole of Ikarepene. Wife of the Senate President Mrs. Unoma Babio in her remark emphasized the importance of agriculture in fostering economic independence and sustaining local communities. She encouraged residents to take advantage of opportunities presented by the initiative which aligns with the federal government's broader goals to empower youth reduce unemployment, and enhance food security. Two months ago, the third lady, the wife of our president, flew off and uh, own a garden. Just small garden in your house. These days, people are even planting yams in sacks. People are planting potatoes in sacks. People are planting a lot of things near their homes. Then federal government has declared it almost an emergency that we must go back to farm. And that is why our senior president said that all of us, we must go back to farm. Federal government is talking about livestock. There is nothing we cannot have here. The school of agriculture, this is where our women, our young men, will learn what to do so that even no matter the space, you have in your community, you'll be able to do something there. Because if sometimes we do things the wrong way, not that we don't make efforts, we make a lot of efforts, but because we don't do it the right way, we don't see the yield. It is time for us to eat what we produce. Let us eat what we produce. And by the grace of God, and by God on our side, we will export what we produce. The initiative also garnered support from local leaders with Econek Bede, local government candidate of the APC in the just concluded Aquibum local government elections, Honorable Umo Ikpe, highlighting the impact of the programs on local economy by creating jobs and improving livelihoods of the farmer. The community license officer, Barrister Akan Mary Udo, also praised the initiative, noting that it will strengthen youth engagement in agriculture and foster partnerships within the community. 
I watched the TV and I saw how emotional His Excellency, the Senate President, spoke about the Senate School of Agriculture somewhere in the southwest. He shows how passionate the family is about agriculture. And all of us in this community shall key in. We only pray that local content, our people here, be made to be involved in every aspect of it. But wholeheartedly, we welcome you. This community was privileged to be one of those included. This community love you and love your family. When it was turbulent, we stood firmly. The record can speak for us. Maybe that's why God has brought you here. So on behalf of our people, it was a dream of our forebears that this place be an educational institute. And that has come to be. That's in Bomchosang. As the president has set a space for us. So I said, you got the best of the entire district. Please, let's appreciate mommy and let's appreciate what we are doing. And we say, may God Almighty, we give God Almighty the glory in Jesus' name. Amen. The Gautam Lakpabio Back to Farm program is expected to provide training, resources, and support to local farmers, particularly young people, as they embark on commercial farming endeavors.